Hello everybody, welcome back to Stoneheart with Banto. So I have some ideas for what we're going to do today. So for the moment we got uh, a house for a weaver, one for the blacksmith and I would like to get a house for our carpenters. I think this is a good spot that we could have for the carpenter. So this is where we're going to make a new house and uh, hopefully try to make it like it could feel like this could be like the carpenter's house. A lot made in wood and so on to fit it together good. We need to move this lamp on away from there as well, so let's put it somewhere for now. Uh, not sure where we want to put it for the moment. I can't like return it to a stockpile, but maybe they will do it later, who, who knows. Rugged survivalists, do we want to buy anything? I don't really feel like we need to buy anything, we maybe want to sell something, however. I think we still have way to like many pelts, we would never like, we would never like m use all of them. That's something that's like pretty much never gonna happen, so. But our people is busy building this house and they have a lot to build. They have this house, they have the farmhouse and then they have this tower by the lake here. So they have quite a bit to build. So a lot of like plans that is made up already. But let's see if we can make some nice uh, carpenter's house here. Let's start with the base. Uh, we're gonna like add, I think a lot of like details to the floor as well. Think about what shape we should have for this. Maybe it goes back quite a bit like this. Maybe like that. I think I will have so there's like a roof over this. Because I would like to have the like columns like this. I think it would look really nice for our carpenter. And we're gonna make the floor interesting as well. So we're gonna make the carpenter's floor stand out a little bit. He's working a lot with wood so I think we should make it stand out a bit. Maybe we can even make so it looks different, so let's try, for example, like, when it, when we come here, it starts to go like this instead. So there we go, we got the floor done for this. So different floors here and another here. For example, we can have, so these are like separate rooms as well, so we have like interior walls for this. So maybe the carpenter would, uh, for example, enter at this place and uh, then go around inside here. I think that would be pretty good. I was thinking if we should have it bigger. I have one idea that I might do. How is it going over here? It seems to be just one, one orc for the moment. But well, this seems to be a work actually. I wonder if we have more orcs around. Don't seem to be any more orcs, so just one for the moment it seems. So we should be pretty fine. Uh, wow, they're using longsword here. That's a nice weapon. I also saw in the comments, uh, Arcane, we're gonna try to hopefully get you, maybe later on, to become our third cleric. I didn't get you to the second one, but uh, you might become our third if we need it, but uh, I think we might need it if we're gonna up the difficulty later on, when we once we get those gongs that we can make the difficulty harder, as far as I understand it. I've never done it, so... So let's do some walls. I think we will use uh, this tool again. Probably gonna be it wrong the first time. No, it was correct. What? Normally, all like you get the wrong every time you do it this way. At least that is my experience so far. So here we're gonna have a door later here. The thing that I was thinking about, if, like, should we have like some special like storage outside, like a little, little hut where they like store some resources, like maybe at the side of it, like maybe here. I think that would be a, like a fun, interesting ID or behind. We will need like an extra door if we're gonna do it. So I think we should like, uh, let's move these. Let's move them, I guess we can move them back here for the moment. But we need these to get away as well. I think the easiest way for to get them away for the moment is probably like to put them somewhere. So uh, let's just, let's just put them here for now. We're gonna move them later on. We got some enemies. I do hear some battle music, so they're... Okay, we got some incoming kobolds. And these guys are gonna be hard. These are like really, really dangerous archers. But maybe we get that hat, because I think that is what we... What we need to be able to like craft these things so we can increase the difficulty. So not enough net worth yet. But let's gather my people so we are prepared to go there and fight them. Hopefully we do not have anyone that's like... Such far away. I think they should pretty much arrive at the same time if we go now. Well, maybe the battle music isn't for those, because they are far away and no one is close to them. But it should be an easy fight for us. 
Look at this, I really love this like armor and weapon and everything, so awesome. Risano, that's a good equipment. And no one is caring for this last one. I think we're gonna deal with them afterwards. Take care of these ones first, should be should be good, I think. Ooh, we got a uh, stamina tonic, let's use it. We barely never like use this tonic anyway, so doesn't really feel like we need to use it either anyway, so. Ooh, we got a plushy toy rabbit. Let's loot that. Very important to get. Some thick leather vests as well. And a little bit of uh, wood. I was thinking about if we were maybe lacking wood because I see that not much is like happening for this. We need to make these uh, wide window frames. Seems like we're not making any of those. But we should have the wood to do this. Uh, I guess my people are busy with something. Probably are. But yeah, let's uh, let's make some of those windows and we get them once we need them. So let's maintain, let's maintain four of those. That should be good. Ooh, people are stuck here, maybe that's why. They can't get down for some reason. Maybe if we add a ladder there, they should be like, they should be able to get down then I think. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, th these things happen sometimes. Sometimes you just gotta have to go and help them a little bit more than you really should need to do, so... But we got them out, so that's good. I was wondering why they were, like, stuck with that, so... So let's go for an uh, door. Maybe a single door. Should we make a reinforced wooden door? I haven't crafted any of those, because we need more things to do those, if I remember correctly. I think we need um, steel or iron for it. Yeah, it's iron ore we need. Let's craft like five of those. Yes, we have a few. That's gonna be nice. Uh, here we wanna have these uh, pillars that I was talking about. We can actually pretty much do them already. Maybe. Might be easier to do it this way. Let's see here. We're gonna get... Uh, let's get one here maybe. One here. Like that. I think we should have one more in here. So I think we're good enough for now. Maybe one more we can add so it goes up. Actually, let's do an interesting thing. Like, let's make every one of these goes up and then we add like... like this. This is like gonna hold the thing up later. We might need to add more later, I'm not sure. We might need to do that. But the thing is, I was thinking about if we, like, remove the middle like this. Might make it look interesting. Doesn't really change the look too much though, but uh, maybe we go that way. I just wanted to, like, really, like, stick out, like, here is the carpenter living. Working a lot with wood. So let's go for an interior wall as well. So that should be good. We're gonna change the color though, it's not gonna be white. The game likes to like change some settings, I don't know why. So I can't select that column for some reason. I could do it before. So here we're gonna have that and um, I think we have like a, We could go for like something like this, but I think we're gonna have a door. A normal door. For this side. And then I think we will keep another door like here. Because I, I think I wanna store some like resources at the side here in a, like a smaller house. Like a little hut or whatever you wanna call it. I think this is pretty good. We need a stairs that we can get up. I think we're gonna have like a second level for this. So let's make a stair that's gonna go up. Maybe we'll make this in stone. Or actually let's make it in wood because it's carpent like I said before. A pretty, pretty wide stair. That's pretty nice, and we also can add some extra touches to this. I just really want to make sure, like, it really looks like the carpenter would be living here, and he's like put so much work to like finish his own, very own house here. Try this reddish one. That really, 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 really sticks out. So that's for reaching second floor. Maybe we should add one there as well. Here we go, and second floor then. 
I pretty much like dragged over most of this. It's gonna be like over this, like I said, also, so. Today we got our stairs, a lovely little stairs. And it's sticking out a little bit here as well, it's gonna be pretty good, I hope. Maybe it should be a little balcony on top of this, I'm not sure, it could be something like that. We don't have to make it like these walls fully straight, should we use this tool again? Let's go for this one. This is the like the thing that you can like customize the best and the most with. The only thing that I don't like about this is that we can drag it like all the way over there for example. I think we drag like this. So now we can select inside that one again, it's weird, like sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't work. Should we go all the way? Maybe we go all the way and have it like really really, really really wide. Like that. I think we're gonna make the roof look, to look cool. And they're getting up here, so let's make some things so they don't uh, fall down and stuff. A lot of woodwork is done to this. That's gonna be nice. Let's make it seem a little bit more real. I think that's pretty good. Uh, I think I want to have like um, a separate room up here as well, where we can have like a, like a bedroom. Pretty big, pretty big bedroom. We're gonna have one of these uh, awesome share uh, like beds. We of course gonna have some other stuff like uh, a wooden dresser. We have a plushy toy if we have one. I guess we gotta have. Oh, here we got it. Some tapestry. Yes, yeah, a lot of stuff in here. We need, it needs a door here as well. I think for like for this side we have a door. That's pretty good. Let's go for some windows then. I'm not sure if we should. We could use this, but I don't think I want to use it. I think I want to use these windows or these windows even. One window for that side. And I think we want to have like a window in the back here as well, close to the bed. So a lot of room light, it's gonna get a lot of light in there. Gonna be nice. One window for that side, and one window for this side. And maybe we go for like two windows like this, so pretty much the same as the other side. So this is a pretty big house for like one profession, but the idea is like that the carpenter is also like going to live in here. And hopefully also like work and maybe like downstairs. He could actually have like have this as his maybe his workroom. Or we will have him like working outside. Doesn't really matter. Because I was thinking about how this like little storage house right next to him. Maybe we have it even in the back, like one storage house and um, like kinda a place where he's working. So let's make a nice roof for this. I'm gonna create a different shape for this. I've pretty much done something like this before. I really like, I like the shape. It's like not pointy or anything, it just looks very, very different. Let's see soon. Like that, and we should have like a dark, dark reddish roof, I think, should be good for this. However, maybe we should have, uh, let's wait a bit and add some more stuff for this. So in the middle we can have one of these, maybe. Let's see, so it's the same nine for that side, and we got... Uh, why can't I use it? Nine for this side, so I got it correct directly, that's nice. So we can have like one of those in the middle. I think we only go for one side with that.
Okay, so now we just need a little bit of finishing touches, like add a little bit like this to the ends. Pretty interesting shape for the house. Maybe something like this, and uh, maybe we should uh, should we remove maybe something, maybe in the middle as well. And have like one line that goes like this. So just a like brighter color in the middle. Remove that one. Let's see, ten there and twelve there. So maybe. Maybe we put one more line here that will go like over the, to the other side. Which is like this reverse tool would work more often, it uh, bugs out very often. Almost beat the network, that's awesome. That is good, good progress. So that's pretty good, he has like something a little bit different. We could have to add for the ends here as well. Before we get that. So that's pretty good, a very like uh, thick house I would say. Very very thick. But I think we're gonna have like a place here where they're gonna pretty much go out a little house where they like pick the resources. And I also think that the carpenter might be working outside as well, but this would be maybe his, his house that he have like saved up everything to make so. I think that could be a pretty fun idea, to be honest. Almost looks like this wall is darker. Yeah, it was dark. I was wondering. I thought it looked different. So I think it looks pretty good with these columns. We got the door. We maybe should have windows, like, here. The bottom. Maybe like that. Quite a bit of windows. I don't think we need anything here. In the back here. Maybe up here we should have... Oh, okay, we already have one there. So I mean, I think we're pretty much done with that. But we're gonna make like a storage for the carpenter and a workplace. Probably something here or something here. I think that's gonna be pretty good. So let's see what you're doing with this. How is it going? Are they stuck again? They might be stuck with something again. Don't see anyone. We do have wood, so that's not a problem. And saw this was also working on something like, if you like lack something, it will be like a symbol on top of it, showing like, okay, this building is like paused for whatever reason. Okay, let's see what my people are doing for the moment then. Everybody's idle. Ooh. Is this one of the houses that they refuse to build? It really seems that way, so... We're just gonna have to do an instant build. I don't want to do this, guys, but uh, we don't want to spend too much time on something that will not be working, so... So hopefully they start to work now. Okay, we got some invaders. Wow, quite a bit of them. Ooh, look at that dude. This dude might be more dangerous than this dude as well, as he has more color on his equipment. So I think these people are a little bit harder, to be honest. So let's see where we got my people. I want to take him out first, I think. Wow, they're far just one ogre. I'm gonna alert my people. Hopefully get them back. Well, he's just going to <laughs> wreck down the doors. Wow. Yeah, so we should like split them up for like different targets, I think. So not like one of my people get like single target. That would that would really suck, you know. Feels like we're maybe missing some people. <laughs> oh, the Bradley's coming over here, the trapper, to fight as well. Uh, let's send him a crystal over here, so she can aggro the ogre. Let's move uh, Yule away from there. And Luna as well, maybe. Don't want to have her like close like that. Let's see how it's going with the other ones. I think we're gonna beat them. We might need to like bring over a healer over here. So, Conrad, please go over here and heal them. Let's 
seems to be going pretty good. There might be someone like somewhere around that we forgot. Okay, so it went pretty good. They need to replace that door though. I think that's maybe the first door that I have had to replace, so I hope they're gonna work that out. But we might need to... I'm gonna make a ladder there just to be sure that they can like... So they can like remove this. But this house, I like this house, it looks pretty good. We need to make this column later also, so let's build that one. Seems like we're not building like the first part of the stairs. Hmm, I see a thing that we need to do that I didn't do with this house. We need to add a little stair for this. We have like two steps or something. That should be fairly easy, we can do it like this. Not sure if we should add it underneath this thing. I think we can just like do it that way. Should be easy for them to make. Not sure what the soldiers are gonna do in here for some reason. They went in there. But yeah guys, uh, I think this will be it for today with Stoneheart. So we got uh, our carpenter's house pretty much done. We might change a few more things for it later on as well. So guys, thanks for checking out this episode. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. And don't forget to check out my Twitch channel. It's in the, the description of each video. So guys, thanks for checking out this video. Have a great, great day. Take care.